Hello Divas. How is everyone doing today? Well, um, for those who don't know me, I'm Julie Clark. I am an owner of Dashing Divas. And I just wanted to hop on here. If you're watching me live, throw me a one in the comments. If you're watching me on replay, hashtag replay. If you feel that this information may be helpful to other moms out there, go ahead and share this video. So, I'm going to tell y'all a little story. I know everybody had an amazing Labor Day weekend. And, hmm, mine wasn't so much amazing. I was sick all weekend. So, I was pretty much in the bed all weekend. <coughs> Sorry. Went to Dr. Sunday. And got me some drugs. Started taking those Sunday afternoon. And they also give you, well, let's back up. Let me just fill you in with how the weekend started. So, I have a huge shirt order I had to get done. My shirts come in Friday. They sent me the wrong shirts. And try to contact them. Well, they're closed for the Labor Day weekend. They won't open back up till Tuesday. I need these shirts done by Thursday. So, I went ahead and refunded that entire order. And ordered them again. Or ordered different shirts that hopefully will send me the right ones. And so that just started off the weekend. And then I was feeling not so good. Not feeling so good. I had my had kid free Friday. My kids were gone. And I didn't even get to enjoy it. Because I didn't feel good. Saturday didn't feel good. Slept almost all day. Got up for a couple hours, slept some more. Got up the Sunday morning, slept some more. Went to the doctor. And you know how they give you a prednisone pack? They give you a prednisone pack. Well, I don't know about all y'all, but prednisone gives me insomnia. So I thought, no, I'm not going to take this right now. It's 2 o'clock in the afternoon. I'll never go to bed. So I didn't. I held off. So I took a four-hour nap. Got up for a little bit. Went back to bed. Got up Monday morning. Well, excuse me, Monday afternoon. Got up at 11. I was like, I'm going to go and just take them. I got to take these drugs. I got to take these drugs. So, I took my prednisone at noon. For anyone who knows me, not a good idea. I need to have that done before 9 a.m. for me to go to bed at night. And so anyway, so I was up all day. I was really lethargic, but I was up. I didn't really do a whole lot. My husband, God bless his heart, he has pulled the slack in all weekend. He's done dinners and he's done everything. Y'all want to see my face? <clears throat> and I've even busted a blood vessel. I don't know if that's from blowing my nose or coughing. I tried to hide it this morning. This is my quick makeup this morning. This is get out the door. I got stuff to do. And all you want to do is crawl back in bed. So, anyway, I digress. So, um, come around, I don't know, got my kids in the bed, got a shower, I was going to go to bed. Well, my sweet honey boo-boo had crawled into bed with my husband and the eight-year-old. So, she pretty much takes up my spot. So, I went and got in her bed. And proceeded to lay there for an hour and a half. Tossed and turned. Wore the bed out. Got up. Tinkered around the house. Went back to bed in an hour or so. Laid there for another. This went on and on. All night long. All night long. So I got up at 4.15 and was like, forget it. I'm not sleeping. Prednisone is like, and I even got the shakes today. Because I took more today. So, me and some other moms were having a talk last week and I know every mom out there you think okay summer's over them kids are back at school praise the Lord mm -mm, it don't stop it don't stop there this is when it gets real folks okay on top of PTO I'm PTO secretary Lenore's the president um we have Girl Scouts we have yet to plan a Girl Scout meeting because we haven't had the time we have every weekend booked up with vendor shows and demos um, if we're not traveling from now to December and it's a fabulous thing for our business yay go business but it doesn't stop 
and we were just talking to like five or six other moms and they were just like it's too much when is too much too much like there's so much stuff you're doing am I doing everything at half pace because I can't give it all my 100% because I have too much in every iron, every fire and it's like okay when do you just be like too much is too much so I have had no sleep and I'm running on prednisone. Okay? I woke up Monday at 11 a.m. And I have yet to be to bed. So we're working on 24 hours right now, my friends. 24 hours. And I'm still running on prednisone. <laughs> so I may get a lot accomplished today when I want to go home and crash. But my body's not going to allow me to do that. Um... I still got to run errands. Just went to ups. Got to go to school. Got to go pick up vinyl. Hope my shirts come in so I can get my shirts made. And I'm just telling y'all, when is too much too much? I know I'm not the only mom out there thinking anything else, anything else I can put on my plate or do for you. And it just may be me and the prednisone talking, but <laughs> I'm just like, okay, okay. When your basket is running over. And you're dropping your basket. Um, trust me. I understand that feeling. But I love you all. And it's going to be okay. And I'm going to go get all my tasks done. Because that's what I do. And go run on my errands. Go up to school. Get everything done I need to get done. Come home. we got to have soccer tonight. And I've got to be making shirts all night and tomorrow. Hopefully my shirts come in. So that's just another stressful situation. But... It's a short time frame to get it done. And I ain't even got my lips on nothing. Look at that. I barely got my makeup on. I was out the door. There's Jan Clark. I love you, Jan Clark. And when is too much too much? Jan always says that. We got too much going on. Too much going on. I mean, we were trying to plan a Girl Scout meeting. We don't even know what day we're going to do that. But we will, we will get it done, as always. It will always get accomplished. But I know I'm not the only mama who feels this way. And I love you all and just know it's going to be okay. And if you ever want to vent, if you ever need somebody to talk to, call us. We are here for you. We will listen to you because everybody feels that way. You want to act like you got your stuff together and you've got a pretty smile on your face and you're walking around like, I got this, I got this. No. You can drop your basket. It's perfectly fine to drop your basket. It will all be okay, Jen Clark. You got that right. And I'm running on 24 hours, honey. I hadn't had any sleep in 24 hours. Maybe I slept too much all weekend was the problem. <laughs> and then add the prednisone on top of it, which causes me insomnia. We all know this. So anyway, I love all of you. And if you ever need anything at all, you let me know. God bless and have a fantastic Tuesday.